Yay. Hey guys, Vaughn here. We're finding people that don't have tanks right now. Yay, we're gonna bully them. Or or they might bully us with the absolute ass ton of anti-tank weapons. Yeah. They got fighter pilots, they got infantry. Oh yeah. Oh shit, I actually shot around, but eh. Oh yeah, my mic is still broken, so you might hear something from my side, like a really cheesy crocodile that will move it up on TV. You know, one of those low budget animals. I was gonna say, how the heck do they already take A2 and A3? I'm like, oh wait, there's only A2. Eh, aim! Eh, aim! There we are. Really? My tank got stopped by a trip. Shooting the cars. Holy fucking shit. I hate paratroopers now. Oh, you don't say you hate paratroopers. Tell me why. Oh, someone just blew a grenade up by accident. Doo -doo. Hopefully, we can hold day one. Nope, we're losing A1. Watch out, guy on point. You're really losing you really lose that quick. Ah, shit, I just got shot. Guy by the gas tanks. I see him. Problem is, he already ran away. Okay, let's just spawn as a guy. Why the fuck? Oh yeah, I always forget that they spawn us so far away. We're at least holding. You can you can just blow up my tank. I'm not gonna be using it. Hey, what the heck happened? Did we just instant lose? No. Yeah. We're just having a very bad day. Oh, you don't think? I'm getting two pieces back my thing. Hmm. Yeah, on my side, everything is choppy as hell, and did we just lose A1 instantly? No, we still have A1. Yeah, I'm like, what the heck, is, what, like, why am I not capping the point? Because we don't technically own A1, but we still control it. A1's currently unclaimed. Get out. And we just got snipers galore over here. Ah, shit. I don't even hear Sherman in doing absolutely jack shit. Here, you can help AG the entire area around this. I don't have AG. Oh, machine gun? I don't even have armor piercers. We're capping it somewhat. He's just trying to keep it, and what the heck ha Oh, they probably panther faust at my car. Yeah, the, the annoying part is they have snipers. Some reason the Russian faction has the most snipers of all factions. Eh, don't let them fully cap it. And they got it. Okay, we got n annoying. I always forget that's a tactic paratroopers can do. And that's also why I wish there's never less than two control points between an objective and an end point. I do agree with you. Because literally they can get two points practically instantly. And now there's the plywood on my screen. Huh? 
the fly wheel on ice cream. Mm. I am sorry, but no, remembering how laggy the game is, this will make me actually go salty. Oh yeah, did you try lowering your settings since you're in here now? I'm busy driving this giant piece of junk. Well, I can at least tell you why there's so many enemy snipers. Anti-tank rifle. One shots people, one shots tank. Well, not one shots tanks. One shots people, or two, two, three shots tanks. And it's a sniper. So yay. This is, this this one's gonna suck, isn't it? This battle, I think we're doing. I haven't I haven't died yet. More have I killed or even done damage. I know. People are hearing nothing but the freaking buzzing of my engine. I know, I'm busy shooting. Oh, they do have a tank. Oh, they do? Yeah, but it's not, it's not very close. Is it the prey tank? Die, bastard. Ah, shit. Parachoopers just raining down on anything that's in their path. from somewhere. And now he's dead. My, ta my tank's dead. I killed one tank. That's all I care about. I know, it's like, okay, what do I send in? Send in the sniper, because I need him to actually just level up our sheer points. A, if he gets to the actual thing where I can use him normally in a squad, I won't be so annoyed. But yeah, we somewhere. need a lot more AA. I killed one tank. I shot it. Now oh. I'm. I killed one tank. What does that do against aircraft? Nothing. I just throw a tank. Yeah, I know. Like we need a lot more AA. I my small victory for one day, okay? I'm just saying what we really need because these paratroopers are what killing us. Where the hell are you, you asshole? We can't let them land. Once they land... Oh great, this is like, a uh, Red Dawn. Th this is literally just Red Dawn. Ow. Well, I killed one tank and headshot at one person. Mm. In one life, that's that's a victory if I ever had one. Yep. Crap, 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 crap. Mm -hmm. Get in the point, get in the point. Graphics quality is low. Display mode, full screen window. Resolution is a. Uh... I'm not even gonna try to re render resolution native. Oh, if we actually got respond. one. If you say lower my graphics, it's then already my load. Game, then my game becomes a black and white cartoon. Ah. Because apparently my quality, visual quality, is low. Okay. So yeah, it just lags. Oh, I know where he is now. I know exactly where this guy is. He's on the goddamn roof. Like on the legit roof? Yep. If I don't see anything up there. I think he's on the roof. Could be out here. Okay, he is on the roof, apparently. Yeah, they're just paratrooping on that side of the roof. 
the, the, the issue is this is literally just going into Red Dawn now. And for anyone what who... What the is Red Dawn anyways? Red Dawn? Red Dawn's the movie about the uh, kids who fight the Soviets after paratrooping in like Kansas or something. Emily, yes, I just said Kansas. What? What? Like, what kind of... Is this like the normal those movies based on historical events or what? Nope. The this was if uh, Soviet Union invaded America via paratroopers. Well, I did read that some of the Soviets actually send their women to war too. Yeah, basically, so, it's just a shitload of men paratrooping out planes as the opening and has school. Oh shit, sniper. Thank you, sir. Med kits. So useful. Uh, med kits. The savior of so many players. Yet also the curse of so many players trying to get them and then dying. Yep. I don't care what people say, I will always consider the bar to be an overly exaggerated assault rifle. The what? Oh, the bar? Oh, yeah. Now. I got killed. I got killed by a parade tank. Wow. So their tanker's not the best in the world. The issue is they just got enough men on the ground. They had a T something and they also a parade tank. Oh, uh, so they probably have a T-34. Yeah, it's not a T-34. No, 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 it wasn't a T-34. That barrel was too short for being a T-34. Okay, so they have two parade tanks then. No! They have two okay. T-34s or a parade tank as our medium tanks. It's a mi- it's a mi- it's the middle one. The parade tank is the one with the really short-ass barrel with the two awkward front barrels. Yeah, then they got the T-34, 76, or the 85. Yeah, they do have two of the same tanks, like America does. I was gonna say, so how do they have two big, how do they have one and another version that's a big ass version of it? Uh, one was a, uh, smaller barrel, and the other upsized its barrel, as well as the Sherman. <laughs> oh no. And oh, I am no. admittedly rusty, so I think the 76 just ran the generic 76 millimeter or 75 millimeter and the 85 upscaled it to the 85 I think or it could be the no it's not the years because both were in World War 2 which were in the 40s I don't remember why could be version numbers oh and you're playing a tanker okay where the heck are you you bastard Yes! In your face! I managed to snipe you through a tree. Okay, how many paratroopers do they still have left? A lot. Yeah, don't paratroopers die like really fast? Eh, somewhat. I mean, you're in enemy lines with no backup. They still have a lot of paratroopers though. They still have 112 paratroopers. That is a lot of... Yeah, so I'm just gonna be... Admittedly, this is a little bit lousy because I see that and I see that. Okay, one tank destroyed. My tank is destroyed. We have, we, we have snipers, we have paratroopers, we got... Heck. I think we got the Soviets launching tanks out of planes at us by now. Wasn't that their idea? That, like... Attaching the, like a like a steering gear and uh, wings on a tank and deploying it for planes. Well, who came up with that idea? That was I. Th that I think was the Soviets. Yeah, like they were supposed to be drop planes. Okay, we got the dash. Yeah, they were supposed to drop tanks from cargo planes and supposedly they would fly to safety. Okay, we need. Window, yes. window, window, window. Send in the Mr. Recruit, or do I? I'm just gonna go for this guy. I'm just. I just want those eight. I just want those eight PCL rounds for my Sherman. That's all I want. Yeah, those That's are so good. Once you actually get them. The Sherman is really, really accurate. 
machine gun is accurate, so that helps. Yeah, the the uh the next level of machine uh, turret. Mine's trying to think of explaining. Munition. No, the uh, next medium tank in this game. The Easy Eight. Yeah, the Easy Eight. Machine gun's a little bit weird, but still fairly okay. And it admittedly has a lot more punching power. Because the reason why I call it the Easy Eight. He got an E and an A. Oh, you... Where the heck are you? Okay, I'm seeing, I'm seeing now. Okay, I don't know where the heck that came from. He's on the hill. He's on the hill behind B2. He's using that as probably a cover spot. That's one of the annoying parts. Man, that's a really flat tank, and it's not, it doesn't help with the fact that the color matches a lot of the background. Wait, what tank did you get hit by? An SU. Oh, tank destroyer, okay. Yeah, a flat tank. It's not so flat. It looks really flat ish. You know, it basically hugs the ground and stuff. Yeah. Really, I'm trying to stay with some tree cover. Uh, it, to... Okay, and Soviets have four tank destroyers, have the SU, and they also have. I forgot what it was called, but apparently the Soviets called it the bitch. Not sure why, but. Tanks weren't always the easiest to handle. No, it does. They were, they were still fairly a new invention. Yeah. Yeah, they were I mean, in development for 30 years, but really define the 30 years of development. Yeah, I, I think there was a program, I'm not sure which side did it, but they actually hired a lot of farmers because tanks were actually basically based on a tractor. I uh, think you might be talking the Soviets. Yeah, you know what kind of tractor I'm talking about, right? A tractor with cabinet. Yeah, a comp tractor, which is also kind of also. Ah, shit. I forgot how annoying this is to aim down. Like, yeah, they said that a lot of. Hi, Tanky Boo. A lot of farmers, but they were kind of familiar with driving something like that. Yep. So, yeah, just so you know, tanks are basically tractors with capital threads and guns. Tractors already have. Well, some depends on the tractor. Okay, that's uh, that's uh, chair chair car chair car. Whatever it's called, the Soviet. I don't know what the heck it's called. I can't remember. Everything yeah, I'm yet. like, shit. It's the it just called armored him. Holy shit! I got hit. And bye bye. Yep, the oh, SU-85. And we're capped. And once again, we're getting capped. This is just becoming annoying. We move forward, paratroopers come in behind us. We are... Oh yeah, we are definitely gonna lose because of that A1 point. We don't have the sheer amount of tanks to take them on at all. They got a good position. They got a perfect position to strike us. Oh, that guy didn't know where I went. Ah, oh, it's a PPD. It's worse. Actually, possibly better. Like... You mean those two guns that practically look like the same thing? Yeah, the PPD. The lower end PPSH. PPD. What was the actual real difference between the two? They look exactly the same. Uh, fire rate, weight, some minor shits. So basically, what games do? Oh, this is this is a this is a knife, but this knife is a blue color knife. Therefore, his stats are better because it's blue tier. Like that kind of ball game. That's what everything kinda did, though. Now. 
Mm, you could say that, but I'm like, is it really something different and it looks the same place? Uh, the T-34 line, the Sherman line. I get your point, but the Shermans just made it, and they made it almost completely different. Like, not just make it look the same, but actually make it different. Like, I think there was a Sherman that had, like, freaking, uh, four brown, four brownies machine, machine guns attached to it and became an AA tank. Yeah, because they just put a different turret on it. Or crocodile. Holy shit! What the fuck was that? That's the Soviet? Okay. I just met the Soviet boat. I did not realize what it was. Just, just yeah, like the, uh, or may I bring up the MP line? Yeah, I'll give you that. A lot of things are minor improvements here, lackings there. And man, we're actually getting a fair episode off this still, though. Okay, that was a literally lucky shot. I was literally behind a rock. And still got my head blown apart. Probably just the ever so slightest up. No, 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 no. Like, like I'm referring to, like, is it a different Sherman model? Because let's say they're both the same Sherman model. But one goes slightly faster. Are they really different? Ah shit, I spotted him way too late. Like, but the, the uh, like the Sherman M1, the Sherman M2, they still were fairly similar to each other. But like, that's what I'm saying, like, was it, was it really like that? Like, this one's slightly faster, therefore it's a whole different tank. It's... It had a better. They changed out the engine and some armor. Probably was clean. I don't know. No engine, armor, and voila. There's your next model. Like, uh, amazingly, the uh, like uh, the best example that people will know if they actually play this game is the MP34 and the MP40. They Holy are shit. almost identical, minus external and ever so slightly minor feeding tube situations. For a split second, I met a giraffe soldier. Huh? For a split second, I met a giraffe on the army. Hmm. You can try. You can probably guess what that is. The weird glitch where sometimes the head just stretches out so much. Oh. Is that a mad draft? Blood draft's good for it. Okay, now the only issue is. There's a tank. Oh, it's a prey tank! I need backup. I'm stuck in the watchtower. Right side, you're right. Well, I think. Right side from where I'm looking at you. Ah, shit, I got shot. Tank down, though. Oh, heck, we pushed 01. We're pulling back somewhat. I, I think we might be able to push this. Oh, shit. Man, that tanker has a really good shot. See, uh -oh. and you said it was a total fail. Wait, you know what? I'm not gonna even say anything because I might be wrong. I'm like, well, we're still going to lose. We got less tanks, we got a third of the people they do. Unless somehow we can bum rush them that single thing. Bum rush with a third less loss. And that would still let them win. Because that would be an even loss rate. So each one of us would have, everyone on our team would actually have to get four kills per death. And I don't think that's so, uh, easy. <laughs> avenge me! I was about to yell that, and I got avenged. Okay, that is a bad idea for our supply truck to be moving in the enemy lines. 
He's trying to just get us in there. It's a forward spawn point that's so risky to spawn on. And I really wish these spawn points were a little bit closer to the defend or the offense. And give us more movement options, but I really hate bridges. You can always swim, but then that's kind of annoying. Yeah, but can tanks swim? They do have paths and only really one tank swims and someone was behind me in the fucking bush. Goddamn bush man. Bushman. Okay, Bushman dead. We're at least whittling down their uh, paratroopers. Yeah, got an anti tank rifle. Nice, be the uh, Soviet sniper I always wanted to be. Yay. And yeah, I'm pulling out my sniper only that way you can get uh, he was here points. Uh, the problem is that it's not even that good against. Heavy armor. Not heavy armor. Oh, I'm jumping. Tank that shot, and I just jumped off the bridge. That's, you clearly got scared out of your boots. Come on, spot them. I'll say, if you ever get recon maxed out, you're fucking evil. Ow. Okay, the parade tank killed me, but I was ducking. H.E. What the fuck is... Okay, the television is having a rave party, apparently. Ah, shit. Yep. We're not having the best, and oh my lord, that spawn truck's in like the worst spot possible now. Remember I thought my hero was dying. Hmm. Wait, you're pulling out a Hellcat? Might as freaking well. Eh. Yeah, I'm at least pulling out something with a decent machine gun. And Oh my god, that is ridiculous! What? I'm just trying to give a U- I'm just trying to get a U-turn. And all of a sudden I get shot like, How much rage do you have? You gotta stay behind cover because people can just see. No, I but still, I like warrior suit. Basically, behind that house, I get shot. I'm like, wow. They talk about spawn kind of they're just taking a little Yeah, and I, I really wish there was like just random zones we'd spawn around. But not like too random. Or I don't know, like have mini objectives. You don't get points, victory points from them, but you at least get a new spawn zone. Yeah, because this is just so easy. It's like, yeah, spawn campers kind of just been pushed back to a few more seconds. So now we get to walk a few steps. Oh, great. My step on a walk. Is there anyone on this roof? No. Gonna get on the point, get on the point, hold the point, man. And a loss. Yeah, that's see you guys in the next episode.